welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really, really well. Sorry if this is a little bit echoey. Sorry if I'm in like a bit of a weird location. If lighting is off, if filming is off, anything like that. But I am in Portugal. I have been here for two weeks or one and a half weeks, something like that. Um, no, today, two weeks, two weeks today. So um, yeah, it's been two weeks since I last filmed a video as well. And I'm really, really sorry about that. But it's just been incredibly hard to find the time to actually film and, you know, edit and upload, all that sort of stuff. I don't have, like, Wi-Fi at home or anything like that, so it's definitely much harder to get um, things filmed, and I really wanted to film some content whilst I was away, but that just meant that I didn't have anything to go up whilst I was here, so... Yeah, but I did do that whole week just before I came, and um, so hopefully that's been uh, fun for you guys to watch if you have been looking for something new to watch. Hopefully those haul videos will have kept you busy um, for a while. But yeah, today we finally have a new house style video, and this time I'm styling espadrilles. I decided to go for espadrilles because I feel like they're quite a summer staple. I'm not going to lie to you, ideally this video would have been up like last week or even two weeks ago. So I do feel like I am kind of pushing it with a summer styling video, but you know, if any of you are going on any holidays towards the end of the month, or if you're currently on holiday, if you're going on holiday in September, or you know, later on in the year, hopefully this will still come in handy. And you can also still wear espadrilles in London too, I think some of these would work really, really nicely in London too. So to kickstart things, I'm gonna start off with these, and these are the latest edition to my espadrille collection. Um, once I had this video in mind, I sort of wanted to get like a few new espadrilles. So these ones are the newest to me. Um, they're from Next and they're a like flat form, platform espadrille, which I really, really love. They've got the kind of um, standard cork espadrille, but then they've also got like some dyed uh, black, which I think is really cute. I do believe these come in like brown as well, but I got them in black. Um, and they're really nice, I really like them. They're definitely different for me. Uh, flat forms aren't necessarily my go-to, but I do really enjoy wearing these. Um, they're super flattering. And um, yeah, I just thought these were quite nice. So, I decided to style these pretty casually. I feel like they're definitely an espadrille you can dress up, but they're also something that you can be quite casual and dress down. Um, so I went for a, whole, a casual thing, in my opinion. I went for a square neck cami top in black, which if you saw my ASOS haul, then you will recognise that cami from that video because I got it just before I came away. And I also wore some denim shorts, which you will also recognise from the ASOS haul because I bought those then as well. Um, and yeah, I really love them. They've been perfect for this summer. And um, it's just kind of a casual thing. I think that's something I would typically wear with Converse, but I just switch the converse for a pair of flat form espadrilles and I feel like it's still super comfy but it just looks like I've tried a little bit harder. Second pair of espadrilles are these and these are like in my opinion kind of more of a standard kind of espadrille. So these are from Topshop um, and they're obviously a lace up so they lace up around your ankle. They're a wedge which I think are the most comfortable. I personally am not, am not too keen on wedges like all year round, but I feel like summer is the time when you can get away with wearing wedges, and I really love these, I think they're perfect. I've seen loads of people styling wedges with like jeans and things like that whilst in London, which I think looks absolutely amazing, but I personally haven't had the chance to try myself. But whilst on holiday, I decided to go for kind of a country vibe with these, so I wore these and really simply just paired them with a white midi dress, which I think is absolutely beautiful. Um, I actually took some pictures whilst I was in my village as well, at beautiful vineyard, and I'm um, wearing this outfit, and I just think it looks so beautiful, it looks like I'm in like, Provence or something like that, um, but yeah, just super beautiful, I feel like the two work really well together, and yeah, I just love them, and I really hope I still get the chance to try and style them up a little bit in London too, um, because I haven't had a chance to yet. And last up, we have a classic from Tom's, I feel like we all know Tom's, or at least when I was younger I used to buy so many of the kind of Tom espadrilles, and these are the latest. These are actually like quite new. I believe they're called like the Alpagata or something like that, um, but I really like them. They're like suede on the top, which is perfect, although I did wear these in London uh, before coming on holiday and it was raining and I thought they were ruined, but actually they look fine. I think in the sun, they sort of, you know, got better, which is really great. But I love these. They again have the espadrille um, sole. Actually, it's not called espadrille. It's sort of like wicker, that kind of thing. Um, the sole and then they're like a suede and I love the colour of these, I think they're so perfect 
And these I love using for traveling. So rather than particularly going to a summer holiday kind of place, if I don't want to take trainers or if I don't want to take Converse with me, then I will wear something like this. I actually wore these um, to Portugal, so I wore these when I was flying. So I wore these with this checkered top, which I really love. It's kind of a red gingham print and a bit of a peplum hem. Again, it's got that square neckline, which I've really been loving on holiday, but I basically wore it like that and I paired it with some high-waisted jeans. I feel like this is something that I would probably wear back home in the UK as well. I feel like it's still pretty casual, but you know, you've still got that nod to summer as well, which is really nice. So those were all the three outfits that I have to share with you. I really hope you enjoyed them. Once again, sorry it's taken me like two weeks, I think, to upload my first video from here, but hopefully you guys enjoyed it and fingers crossed I will have another video up for you next week, hopefully at 9am on Sunday. I feel like my schedule at the moment is a little bit all over the place, well it's definitely all over the place, but as long as this video goes up then hopefully you will have another sometime next week and then I will be back in London as well, so hopefully things will get back to normal, but yeah. Really hope you enjoyed this video. As always, you know what to do. Let me know which outfit was your favourite in the comments down below. Was it outfit number one, number two, or number three? Let me know what you'd like to see next in my How to Style series. I'm really excited about starting to shoot some autumn pieces. So let me know what you'd like to see for autumn, um, again, in the comments down below. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new. And I will see you all next week. Bye.